Tell me about how you found out about his 100th win. I found out on Facebook and I was very upset because if I had known he was anywhere near close to that, I would have been there. I don't mind driving the 140, 150 miles. From, so from I, Finley? Yes, I cried a lot. I cried. So tell me about Darnell. What's he like? Darnell is very ambitious. He's fun. Kids absolutely love him. He is my proud son. He would never allow anyone to say anything negative about his family, especially his mama. Never. And uh, he's a great mathematician. He's always been great in the algebra, geometries. He's well liked. Um, he's he's a great guy. He really is. Even if he wasn't my son, I, I, I probably would say, gosh, who is that? He's that friendly guy, that ambitious, that passionate. He's very passionate. He's, he's like me. Uh, when I play a game, I want to win. Now, I'm a good sport, but I want to win. So I'm very passionate. Uh, what was he like playing basketball? Oh. Uh, and tell me about growing up playing. Ferris. Ferris, he was a point guard. Point guard in high school, point guard in college. He he was fierce. I mean, he he's passionate. He plays to win. He plays hard. He plays very very hard. And um, you know, even the opponents, most of them like him. They say that guy's pretty cool. What, what, where did he go? Uh, go to grade school and high school and college? Um. Darnell went to, as a matter of fact, I transferred him to Washington School. We were in the Wilson Vance area, but Wilson Vance did not have the diversity. Uh, Wilson Vance um, was a, what you would consider maybe a higher class school economically, but I didn't care about that. I wanted Darnell to be at a school where there's diversity in color of skin diversity and, and status and economics and he he loved it he did well the teachers loved him he made many friends that still get in touch with him he went to of course uh, Central Middle School that's my school too and then Finley High School and then on to Bluffton College um. and I remember telling him uh, it was a tough game. He had a tough game, but I said, son, this is a stepping stone. I said, God's got great things for you. You know, keep your chin up, everything's gonna be all right. And I knew he was gonna be a coach somewhere. I, I, I really did, I knew it in my heart. So. I need to go back and get in the locker room and see what he's like in the locker room. I've never done that. Uh, but I, I like how he coaches, his enthusiasm and encouragement. I think people here really do like him. And, and you know what? He coached boys too. If you look at that video that they did for him, you will hear kind words from some of the guys he coached. Like, Coach, you didn't just coach me in basketball. You coached me in life. And I told him, son, basketball's fun. I said, life's real. So he makes a positive difference on these young people's lives. And that's what it's all about. And I wouldn't have it any differently for him. He's got to make a positive difference that will carry on in their lives. He, he sure got a good team together this year that he plays does. hard every game. I love these girls. They're my loves. <laughs> Do you remember a really funny story growing up or while he was playing or something? Oh, I can't remember the team, but I'm sitting up in the stands and, and most of the people, they know me because I'm, I'm passionate, I'm boisterous, I'm always cheery. And they were down to the wire against this team. And they were down two points, two points. Who makes that two points? Duh. Nail Parker and the principal flew down there. She was a tall lady, about 6'3. She flew down there fast. My mother, who was 70 some, she flew down there, got down there before I did. But oh, what a what a celebration it was! So it was a lot of fun.
And I just love the teacher saying, you know, we really like that guy. And the principal saying, hey, we really like that guy. He, he's just a good guy. He's a good man. He's a good dad. He's, he's a good fatherly man. He's a good husband. He's a good husband. He's a great guy. He's a great guy.